Hello there ladies, gentlemen, and everyone in between. TacticalBacon00 here bringing you a tutorial on how to fix XSplit's new chroma key settings and get your old settings back. This may look familiar if you are an XSplit user. You have your green screen right behind you, perfectly set up with no issues whatsoever. You turn on chroma key and you only have these two sliders. And it doesn't matter how far you adjust either slider, it either makes everything too fuzzy, or you have problems like my chair right here behind me, ghosting, and you can see through my chair. Doesn't matter which sliders go which way, your settings just don't work, and it looks very unprofessional. So this is how to fix those settings, get your old ones back. It's a little bit of a process, so I'm here to show you how to get through it. First thing you're going to want to do before you even start is go ahead and save a backup of your presentation on your desktop or wherever you want to save it. Just know that you will need to find it later. Then once you save that backup, go ahead and exit. Then what you are going to do is you are going to go to your control panel. You are going to go to programs and features. The bottom of the list because XSplit is an X. Uninstall that, and then I will fast forward this part because this is boring. Alright, the old version of XSplit is now uninstalled. Now what you are going to do is go ahead and go to the XSplit.com slash download site. You're going to hit the download link for XSplit 1.2. You're going to download that and immediately open it. I already have it downloaded, so you're going to install the old version of XSplit. Once again, I'll fast forward through this because it is boring. I'm pretty sure you can handle installing a program. Once XSplit is done installing, go ahead and launch it. It will launch its site, because why not? I'm going to hide this window from you while I type in my email and password, because that's none of your business. During that first launch, XSplit will say, there is an update available. A newer version is available. Choose no. You just installed the old, old version. You do not want to mess that up. Cancel all prompts for updates. Then go ahead and load the presentation that you saved earlier. Adjust all of your settings to what you want them to be, such as the resolution, the camera capture. For some reason, the LifeCam Studio chooses to revert to 640 by 360 every time it's launched. So, now that you are here, you go to color, chroma key and you can pick your perfect chroma key settings go ahead and do that find your perfect balance of every little thing you want make sure it is good works with all of your sources because there will be no changing it once this process is finished unfortunately this is one of the downsides of XSplit having the new update. There we go. I think that's a pretty good, pretty good chroma key. Pretty good chroma key. There's no ghosting. There's a little bit of ghosting on the back of my chair. Just adjust the knobs to exactly what you want. And I think this is pretty good for my little life cam studio. Believe me, the quality can be much better. Um, my preference is a Logitech C920, which I will be showing you in a moment. Alright, once you have the perfect settings, go ahead and save the presentation one more time in that backup that you made earlier. Then what you're going to do, go to Help, check for updates, and once again, it will ask you if you want to update answer this time is yes. 
I'm going to fast forward once again. Congratulations, you now have the latest version of XSplit. This is the most up-to-date version as of right now. Checking for updates, there is no new release. You still have your old settings. Do not hit any of these radio buttons or adjust any of these sliders because otherwise these settings will not stick. Um, enjoy your wonderful, wonderful old XSplit chroma key settings. Just to give you an idea of how good this can look, this is what the scene looks like when captured from a Logitech C920. Very high quality, barely any jagged edges anywhere, absolutely fantastic. Unfortunately, you have to jump through all of these hoops just to get to it. My name has been Tactical Bacon 00. Thanks for watching my video. Bacon out.